Hey guys, how's it going? Apex here, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to connect and use your PS3 controller with your PC using SCPDS3. Now, as it states in the title, the method that I'm going to be teaching is compatible with Windows 10, but has also been successfully tested with Windows 8.1 and 7. So to start off, you're going to want to click on the first link in the description, which will take you over to a mega download page. This download page has a folder which, con which contains all the software that you're going to need to configure your controller. While that's downloading, plug your PS3 controller into your PC using your controller's mini USB cable, so if your controller does need to have dr default drivers installed, it can begin that process automatically. Anyway, we're going to create a folder in our programs file, program file section to host the files of the SCP software to begin. So start at your local C drive, go to program files, and then just right click, new, and then create a new folder call, called scarlet.crush productions. However, I've already done that beforehand, so there's no need for me to create a du duplicate version. Next, just drag and drop the bin folder from our SCP server file, or folder. Continue. Then open up the bin folder and locate the SCP driver file. Next just right click on it and run that as administrator. Then ensure that configure service has been checked. Whilst the Bluetooth, while, whilst the Bluetooth driver option is completely optional and only for those that are looking to connect their PS3 controller with a dongle. Then just click on install. And under the summary here, everything should look relatively similar to this. Now, I'm not sure if it says it here some, uh, somewhere up here, but you will want to restart your computer for all of the new drivers and all of the settings that this program has customized to be applied. So I'm just going to come back right after I've restarted my PC. Alright, so my PC has finished restart restarting, so now what I'm going to do is open up the same bin folder from my scarlet.productions folder, and then I'm going to find SCP monitor, and then right click and run that as administrator. Next, I'm going to click on the show hidden icons button, and then find this logo in the tray. And as you can see, it shows a bunch of letters and numbers basically anything besides disconnected under pad 1 which signifies that my PS3 controller is 100% working and all I would ne now need to do is configure it in my games so one more thing to consider and remember is that this SCP system essentially emulates your PS3 controller as an Xbox 360 controller so your games your OS and programs might detect your controller as an Xbox model as opposed to a PlayStation one also note that if for some reason this does not work, you may want to experiment with di with disabling driver signature enforcement if you are a Windows 10 user. I'll have a, I will have a link in the, in the description which has an article that talks about how to do that, so check that out if you're having issues. Anyway, I hope this video did help you guys out. Leave a comment down below if you, did, if you do have any questions, concerns, or suggestions for future video ideas. And if you did find the video helpful, please consider hitting the like button. You can also hit the subscribe button if you want to stay tuned for more high quality tech content as I upload new videos one to two, one to two times a week with a guaranteed upload every Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.